Oh, that's nice. Did you like that, folks? That's Al Martito's very latest single on Capitol called Kentucky Morning. Thank you very much, Ed. Al, it's a pleasure to have you on with us well, again because it's been so frequent. Well, it's, it's certainly nice to be back again. Uh, one of the reasons why I came here was to, to look at my property again. Back in Atlantic oh, City. I thought that you came back to this area to do a couple of wine commercials. I didn't know. Oh, really? No. You really know how to hurt a guy. <laughs> Not be. I would <laughs> say that. I mean, that's just a marvelous family. There are stars all over your that's family. That's right. That's you right. don't know what I'm talking about, do you? Should I mention it? <laughs> oh, it's up to you. <laughs> well, no, it's up to you. You tell me whether it's, it's all right. right. Anything right. you want to say? Okay. Well, uh, Al's brother in law is Armin Saratano, who records on the. Uh, Rosé wine label. He's got, a, he's got some good wine there. That's right. He's got a new album out called Chapter 12. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I wish him good luck. But I wish you better luck. I know that this is last year's album. This is the current album. Really. Well, this uh, particular album was recorded about a year ago. Actually, uh, it came from a single record called Volati. We recorded that a couple of years ago. It was a big hit internationally. And what we did was just uh, package a new album called Volati and... Uh, did very well. Yeah, well, uh, Kentucky is actually from a new album. That's no, K complete. Kentucky Morning was just recorded, Ed. Now, the, the uh, new album is, is in the process of being recorded now, so it won't be out for another several months yet. Oh, and I then see. Kentucky Morning will be in that album. Yeah, well, you go out and buy the single anyway, because uh, it's, it's terrific. You make such nice music. You know, I've told you this before, folks. Uh, I've known Al Martino for a long time. Uh, but we can't hide that, can we? No, you can't hide that. We, we've known each other a long time. Well, you've played my records ever since 1952. Is it 50? On, on WPEN, so you're Whoa. not only a man that plays my record, but you're a very old friend of mine that I've known, and uh, I can always depend on Ed Hurst, really. Well, thank you very good. much. But we can depend on you for good music. I will tell you folks this. Of all the artists in show business, and I must have interviewed 50,000 of them since I've been around, I don't know of any artist who has better relations with the guys that spin the records and the people that program the music, then Al Martino. He, 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 he has a way about himself. He walks in and makes himself at home, or he'll pick up a phone and call a guy. You know how good that makes a person feel? Well, I think it's very important. There's an awful lot of competition out there. A lot of people are making records. There's only so, so much airtime on the radio. And I think it's a, it's a big advantage if you could have this rapport. Well, I'm glad you stopped by from California into our WPVI studios once again to grace our Steel Pier screen. Thank you, Ed. It'll be a pleasure to see you again. Thank you. Al Martino. Want to buy some wine? That's a nice. <laughs>